After its earlier rollout in Austria, KTM has completed its first proper test with the KTM RC16 MotoGP bike at Valencia. On Saturday and Sunday, test riders Alex Hoffman and Mika Kaleo put the KTM RC16 through its paces on the Spanish track. The test sees KTM stepping up the pace of development on the RC16. Alex Hoffman has been used as a development rider to verify the bug is working correctly and is being developed in the right direction. New hire Mika Kalio has been brought in as the performance rider, the 33-year-old Finn freshly retired as a full-time racer, and therefore having the speed to push the limits of the bike. Kalio also has more recent experience of MotoGP machines, having ridden for Pramac Ducati in 2010, and having tested the Suter CRT MotoGP machine in 2012. Calio was known in his former teams for his attention to detail and ability to pinpoint areas that needed improvement. In a press release, shown below, Mike Leitner, the man leading the MotoGP project, pronounced himself very happy with the progress of the bike. KTM is working towards preparing the bike for a full-time return to the class in 2017, though KTM CEO Stefan Pira recently told German-language publication Speedweek that they intended to contest the last race of 2016 at Valencia. The interview with Pira contained a number of interesting details. It was already well known that KTM would be using a 90-degree V4 engine housed in a steel trellis frame, but Pira revealed that their engine is already making around 270 horsepower. The bike is using a seamless gearbox, developed in conjunction with X-Track. Though KTM have already asked Dorna CEO Carmelo Espoleta for a wild card entry at Valencia, they could enter earlier should the bike be ready. The key to success for KTM's project will be the ability to hire a competitive rider for 2017. That will require them to show fast times during testing. No times were released from the Valencia test, and as the project is still at such an early stage, there is still a lot of testing left to do.